Tansi, everyone. I want to take this opportunity to congratulate each and every one of you on your graduation. As you contemplate the next step in your life, whether you're headed for another degree or the job market, there may be some times ahead when you'll encounter situations that will challenge you. The most important thing to remember is where, wherever life takes you, be true to yourself. Stick to your values, walk in the footsteps of your ancestors, and you can't go wrong. I wish all of you every success. Hi, my name is Vicky Baldo. I'm the cultural support worker at the Otsunhakta Student Center. And I'm here today to wish you or to send you a wonderful congratulations. I'm really proud of you for persevering and for the determination that it took to uh, get to this point. And so congratulations on your uh, graduation. And I hope that Concordia has provided you with not only an education, but with some connections, um, with lifelong friends, with good relationships, with uh, good supports in place that can um, help you as you move forward into either furthering your education or uh, as you enter uh, the, the workforce, um, where, wherever it is that you're moving on to. Um, I do, I wish you all the best. I am incredibly proud um, of all the students and uh, it has been an immense honor and a privilege to work with all of you. Um, and yeah, just I, I'm wishing you a really good summer. Uh, I hope that you get time for rest and play and uh, for family and the simple things that can nourish your heart and uh, give you give you restoration so that you can continue on in your projects that are coming up. So all my best wishes to you and uh, congratulations again. Hi, hi. Ekose. Tanse. My name is Catherine Richardson and my Cree name is Kinu Esqueu and I'm the director of First People Studies at Concordia University. So I'm making this little video because I want to heartily congratulate all the First Nations, Métis, and Inuit Concordia graduates of 2021. This is a really um, special time, uh, worthy of celebration and great joy for all of us here at Concordia, and probably um, most of all for you, the students who, um, have reached this really important milestone. And it could be a time of transition, but it could be that you've been doing lots of things all along, you know, reading, learning, being in community, educating yourself, parenting children, working, dealing with COVID, all these things have gone alongside your, your hard work and your studies this for the whole year and maybe even before that. So this is no small feat. You really deserve to pat yourself on the back, receive the congratulations of your loved ones, your friends, your family, your community, your pets, and uh, just uh, take some time to really acknowledge um, this big feat that you've just accomplished. So in terms of the future, I hope that you'll stay around and be in the Jojage community, keep connected to Concordia. Um, I trust that some of you will probably want to come back and continue your studies, doing a, a master's and then maybe a doctorate. And just know that you are so special to your community and everyone's life just becomes richer and um, fuller because there's people like you who come away and, and engage in some really important learning. And some of you will take that back and share it with your community. Some of you will share it with the wider society. 
And some of you maybe will just go on and hold that knowledge quietly inside yourself. Um, but know that we at Concordia have been blessed by having you here with us. And I just wish you all the good things in the world, on your land, here on Turtle Island, in Jojage, and wherever you may roam. I hope that life is always good to you. All my relations. Hi, hi. Hi, everyone. I'm, I'm Dr. Heather Gliliukti. I teach in the Department of Art History, and I hope that we've met. Maybe we haven't had the opportunity to meet, or maybe we don't know each other as well as we wished. Maybe we know each other incredibly well. It doesn't matter. I just want to say uh, that I am proud of all of you. I'm so incredibly proud of the amazing work that you've done and that you have accomplished this huge thing, and I'm excited for what your future holds. You know, you've made your your family's proud, you've made your communities proud, you've made your ancestors proud, and you certainly made the Concordia community proud. Um, best wishes for what the future holds and congratulations again. My name is Azure. I'm the student support assistant at the Otsunhakja Student Center. I haven't been in the position very long, so unfortunately I haven't had the chance to meet all of you, but I do know some of you and others I may have met through a phone call or an email, or even a Zoom. But either way, I'm here to wish you a huge congratulations on graduation. Make sure you celebrate safely, but have fun, and enjoy your summer. Ona. Aloha, my kako. Uh, congratulations to the, the graduating class of 2021. I hope you all are able to take a moment and breathe in and breathe out. And I really appreciate the amazing accomplishment that this graduation represents for you and for your families and for your communities and for all of us. Um, we're super proud of you and we recognize all the hard work and the perseverance that it required to get to this point. And boy, are we looking forward to what you do after this. So enjoy, congratulations, much love. Hello, bonjour, I'm Graham Carr president of Concordia University. And on behalf of the entire Concordia community, I want to offer you a hearty congratulations on this important milestone in your life. Of course, it's too bad we can't celebrate your achievement together in person, but I know that the OSC, like the university, has worked very hard to create a strong virtual presence over the course of the last 16 months. And I, I hope you've been able to enjoy the virtual resources and the community and student-led events the OSC has organized this past year. The Aboriginal Student Resource Center has been a great help to more than a generation of Indigenous Concordians since it opened in 1992. But this year, its name was changed to Odsenhagda Student Center. The meaning of this new name, near the fire, a place that provides warmth and safety where counsel is given and ideas are shared between equals, perfectly encapsulates not only what the OSC is about, but what we strive to make Concordia represent to all our students. It's by creating that sense of warmth, community, and a safe place to exchange ideas that we aim to help our students and ourselves learn and grow. During your studies here, you've become better equipped to navigate adversity, be resilient in the face of change, help others, and contribute to the social fabric. And my hope is that you'll emerge from your studies amidst this crisis feeling optimistic that you can make a positive difference in society. The Concordia family is extremely proud of you. Stay safe, stay healthy, and thank you for choosing Concordia.
Away, 